And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and my partner, ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk, is Stuart Robson. And really looking forward to bringing you live action from the Hero Indian Super League. It's ATK Mohan Bagan, and they take on FC Goa. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations, and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, although we have it down as a 4-5-1, it's actually more likely to be a 4-2-3-1. They play with two holding midfield players, a number 10 and two wingers. The system has a nice balance to it. And now they get the ball rolling. Shetri. It's with Alvaro. Determined defending. Chance to play it in. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Can he finish? Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Short corner favoured. And no way through. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. And since they have the ball, a referee playing advantage here. And that pass could be troublesome. And keeping it out. Let's get the latest on the injury situation from our pitch side man, Jeff Shreves. Medical staff just indicated to me that he was actually trodden on in that last challenge. That's why he's treading on it so gingerly. Keep an eye on it. Cheers, Jeff. Nicely timed tackle. Petratos. And with that, the attack fizzles out. He's got the right idea with that pass. Will he finish? And a goal! 1-0 it is. They've been pushing for the opener and now they have it.
Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1 0. And the keeper can gather. Not the pass he had in mind. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. And it's played into the centre. Can he fire it towards goal? It's in! They're looking really relaxed and confident and not giving the opposition much of a look-in. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it, but I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it shouldn't go in at that near post. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, such is the lot of an attacking player. Some days it works for you, on other days, not at all, Stuart. Yeah, he's been well marshalled so far, but he hasn't worked the defenders or the goalkeeper hard enough. He's got to impose himself on this game, otherwise they're going to struggle to get back into this. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. This looks threatening. Will he find the net? In it goes! A three-goal cushion! This is astonishing stuff! Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. Nice looking pass. Over the touchline for a throw in. Determined defending. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Surely! And how well the keeper did. Well, that's just exceptional. He reacted so quickly there. And the substitution will occur now. Short corner it is. Let's and a throw in is going to be. Check three. three. And just, just narrowly wide. Well, it's a good effort from that range, but I think it had it covered. covered. A 
that's well, that's so stats tell us. But they're attacking the way today is really exceptional. Their defenders have come out at the right time. Midfield have completely dominated the game. And the front right player's movement has been excellent. Nice nice out. Here. Well, this this again. Again. This this might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. opportunity. Well, they profit from this situation. Good, good bit of pressing. to do it on his own. Well, we're well, nearly there. there. This game almost, almost over. And, and looking at the fans, Stuart, they appear, they appear to be to be more, more than a bit dusty. Well, well, this, well, this is certainly a performance game, because, because they've been totally outplayed out today. How, how many times have they been up and down during this game? How have they been better than this? It's been a dismal display. Tremendous, tremendous intuition to win it back. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. And then there goes the final whistle, much to the disappointment of their supporters. It was the nature of the performance more than anything else. They never got out of second gear and were completely dominated all over the park. Tell you what though, I wouldn't want to be in that dressing room right now. Well, Stewart, he really has had a lot to say for himself out on the pitch. Well, he was a major reason why they won today. He was so reliable and he inspires those around him. 